the show of embellishments. Real new developments won't be available at retail for a few years. HDTV, the wider, brighter, clearer television system, was on display, but a consumer version will have to wait until the 90s. Stay tuned for CNN.com. You can always find great new toys at the Consumer Electronics Show. Improved electronic still cameras, for example. Portable CD players of varying degrees of portability. A high-tech teddy bear, somewhat more aggressive than Teddy Ruxpin, that serves as a car alarm. Flat liquid crystal televisions grown from 2-inch midgets to 14-inch size. Earth-shaking new ideas were in short supply, though, as the retail buyers for the electronics industry were shown mostly variations on existing equipment. The CES might be called the show of embellishments. Really new developments won't be available at retail for a few years. HDTV, the wider, brighter, clearer television system, was on display, but a consumer version will have to wait until the 90s. Home automation, the remote control fanatic's dream, is now on the horizon, now that most manufacturers have agreed to a single standard. Last year's headline grabber, the digital audio tape player, was hard to find this year. DAT has been blocked by the record industry because they're afraid it's the perfect weapon for copyright pirates. Sony, one of DAT's biggest backers, is still hopeful. The last meeting was two months ago. There's another meeting scheduled in the next two months to continue to look for a resolution. Others believe if DAT doesn't start selling soon, a recordable compact disc expected in a year or two will kill it. Another battle has come to an end, though. Jack Valenti, president of the Motion Picture Association, fought to keep the VCR out of America in the early days of the video age. He came to Vegas to celebrate the armistice. A VCR really is barren of all value until you, you illuminate it uh, with a good movie. So I think we, we do have a joint interest in the future. The future seemed brightest, though, at the Nintendo booth, where the video game system celebrated two years in a row as the top Christmas present. New games and new accessories are coming online. The action pad and the hands-off U-Force controller promise to keep the video game in flight. With or without earth-shaking new developments, hundreds of millions of dollars change hands at the Consumer Electronics Show, where the course of home entertainment is plotted for the next six months. Dennis Michael, CNN Entertainment News, Las Vegas.